Hi, I'm Sumit Thakkar. I'm VP of Engineering at Qualys, uh, and I'm going to talk about the announcements that we have made at Black Hat. Uh, we've made three announcements, uh, starting with the Web Application Scanning 2.0. Uh, this is the first new application uh, that we have released on our new SaaS platform, which is uh, Java-based that we've been working on. Uh, the main purpose of this is to industrialize scanning of web applications. Uh, today, there's not enough tools uh, out there that are able to take uh, 50, 60, 100, or 1,000 applications and scan them on a regular basis. Uh, and the, the goal here with Qualys' new application scanner is the ability to discover applications on your network, be able to catalog them, and then be able to scan them all with one click, do it through a SaaS model without having to install anything, and then do that uh, with high quality on a regular basis. We also have announced um, a new UI as part of this initiative. Uh, this new UI uh, sort of represents the growth of uh, Qualys and the way it has gone from just being a vulnerability management company to adding more and more security products like uh, policy compliance uh, uh, as well as web application scanning. So this new UI is extremely interactive and allows users a very easy way to navigate between the various um, uh, security applications that we provide. Uh, without being able, without being cluttered in the UI with the functionality of other modules. So when you are in uh, policy compliance, you only see information related to policies. This is sort of the paradigm that we are following, being able to create dynamic UIs that are uh, that adapt to the user who is using them, and then also in the future will adapt to the devices that the users are using them on. Uh, today, everybody expects uh, availability of their data on various mobile formats, and uh, Qualys is very well positioned, being a SaaS platform in the cloud. So the goal with this new UI is also be able to add a, a lot of context to the tasks that you are doing at hand. Um, and so you will start to see the rollout of this beta of the new UI, which is available for existing Qualys Guard users. Uh, today, so when they log into the application, they will be able to switch to the new UI and try it out with their existing data, and will be able to switch back and forth for a few months while the UI is in beta. Uh, and uh, we are looking for feedback, and then at some point we will cut over to the new UI. Uh, we are already seeing that is being very well received by our customers. So with this release of the consultant module, we are also uh, announcing the availability of customized reporting for consultants. So the consultants can now actually create reports that are customized for each engagement that they go into. So they, when they generate a report, they can actually provide information about the customer, about the consultant themselves, and the methodology that the consultants use. That really uh, reduces the time that it takes for them to create these reports that they give to the customers. Um, we are also allowing them the ability to download the entire scan result in an editable format so that they can actually, if they would like to go a step further, they can then go and uh, modify these reports to a, a much greater extent if they would like to add some uh, other data into this report. Uh, so when you take all of that together, it really makes a very good and compelling consultant package because not only do we bring vulnerability management, policy compliance, and web application scanning, but we also bring a lot of other correlation information about exploitability and malware that we uh, provide as part of these reports so that uh, the consultants can help the customer uh, prioritize their remediation efforts. Uh, and we already have the, the possibility of taking Qualys Guard scan results and being able to use that with various pen testing modules like uh, core impact as well as with uh, Metasploit. We really hope that these products are going to be very well received in the marketplace and uh, we would love to hear feedback. Uh, for any feedback uh, and to get more information about uh, these releases, you can go to community.qualys.com uh, and uh, a lot of documentation is available there as well as you can provide your feedback and have discussion with other people who are also looking for similar information.